Richard the Giraffe by Sarah Levine, Standard K, LS1, 1. On the wide open plains of Africa, a baby giraffe was born to his loving mother and father. This newborn baby giraffe's name is Gertrude. Gertrude must learn how to stand up and walk on his wobbly long legs. He's a little clumsy at first, but he will get better with practice. In no time, Gertrude is running around and playing with the other baby giraffes and making friends. Richard's mother does a great job at protecting him from lions and other predators. They're scary. Gertrude will drink milk from his mother until he becomes old enough to eat from the tall trees and low grasses like the older giraffes. Gertrude begins to grow bigger and taller and is able to start eating the leaves and twigs off of the wild trees. Some of the trees are still a little hard for him to reach though. He eats the leaves and branches of acacia, mimosa, and wild apricot trees. His favorite meal is acacia leaves. Gertrude means food to provide him with the energy he needs for growing, activities, maintaining body warmth, and body repairs. water begin to become scarce in the area where Gertrude lives because there has been little rainfall the past year. The plants that the giraffes eat for food need water to survive. They start to die off and leave very little food for Gertrude, his parents, and his friends to eat. The drought that is occurring is forcing Gertrude his parents, and the other giraffes to move in order to survive. Gertrude is a little nervous for the long journey that they have ahead of them, but his parents encourage him that he's strong enough to make it to their new home. They need to find a new home that has been getting more rainfall than their old home. The rain will mean more trees to eat and water to drink. Giraffes aren't the only animals that need to move because of the drought. Hyenas and lions need water too. They also feed on the giraffes. When the giraffes and other animals move, it leaves the hyenas and lions without any sources of food. After a long walk, they finally make it to their new home. Gertrude didn't think that they would ever make it. What a journey. Look at all of those trees and how much water there is. Richard could hardly believe his eyes. He decided that this would make a great new home for himself, his parents, and his friends. Richard made some friends at his new home too. This is his new best friend, Gracie. The giraffes and other animals are so happy at their new home where they now have enough food and water to survive.